Hi, it's Doug Wolf with Town Real Estate Group, and this morning we are bringing you the rain statistics for the cities of Norfolk, Virginia Beach, and Chesapeake. Uh, this is information that we just got. It is based upon this past January, January 2015, versus January 2014. We're going to look at some of the trend lines, uh, what the numbers look like as far as percentages. Certainly, if you're a buyer or a seller, this is important information for you to see what the trend lines look like uh, versus last year at this time. All right, so we're going to get right to the numbers, and this morning we're looking at the cities of Norfolk, Virginia Beach, Chesapeake for January 2015, and here you can see the city of Norfolk had 1,405 properties on the market, real estate properties on the market for the month of January. In comparison to last year at this time for the month of January 2014, that's a 9.17% increase, which is great because we definitely need more inventory in all three cities. So the city of Norfolk is uh, doing its part by increasing it by 9%. The number of units sold, 152 units sold, it's pretty close to where it was last year at this time, 3.4% uh, increase, which is great. We're seeing a, a uptrend lines in both number of units and number of units sold. And the median price also a slight increase at 1.5% to take it to $152,250. And that's a month's inventory of 6.45, which is a completely normal market, pretty much between four to nine months of inventory is a normal market in our area. Moving down to the city of Virginia Beach for the month of January 2015, 2,381 properties were on the market in uh, January, and that's an 11% increase uh, since last year, which is another great trend line. We need more inventory. So we're getting some more homes on the market, some more movement, and uh, 309 units sold. Once again, another good number, 3.4% in the city of Virginia Beach for growth as far as number of units sold versus last January. And a great number, $236,680 is our median sold price, which is a 7.61% increase over last January. So fantastic trend line there. We're uh, seeing Prices uh, are starting to go up a little bit. They're catching back up to where they need to be. Um, and, and that's a great number for the city of Virginia Beach for the month of January. 4.84 months of inventory. That number right there is, cl is clearly showing you that we still are low in inventory in the city of Virginia Beach. And uh, we're still certainly room to grow from that. Looking at the city of Chesapeake, 1,542 properties were on the market for the month of January in the city of Chesapeake. And that's a huge jump from last year uh, for the month of January, 15.94, I mean 16%. Uh, increase of inventory for the city of Chesapeake. I'm going to say that that is a lot of new construction. We're seeing a lot of new construction in Chesapeake, um, which is great as long as it can support it. And it looks like it is because we've got a number of units sold 200, which is a 26.58% increase of units sold versus last January. So that's a nice, nice jump. But there's got to be a glitch somewhere. And so there's a little bit of a glitch. When we start seeing the new construction kick in, what is that doing to prices? Well, depending on what the price point is, it could drive them up, could drive them down. Median sold price, $212,573 for the city of Chesapeake in January. And that's pretty much exactly where it was last year at this time. So even though we've increased the amount of inventory, increased the number of units sold, we haven't seen growth in the median sold price. We're pretty much negative 0.08 is, is pretty much just zero. And um, so not, not seeing growth in the sold price for the city of Chesapeake for the month of January. And certainly a dead on normal market, 5.45 months of inventory. So good information. If you're a buyer or a seller, it's definitely data that you need to know about what's going on. Uh, as we get into the months, you'll start to certainly see an increase. As you can see last year, what happens? Well, the properties, we start to increase, and we pretty much cap out June, July, August for the number of uh, properties that we have on the market. 
and uh, we certainly see prices start to go up as we get into warmer weather as well. My name is Doug Wolf, and I am the uh, principal broker at Town Real Estate Group. If there's anything I can do to help you, please don't hesitate to give me a call, 757 515 47 28, or you can always uh, go to my website, bettercalldoug.com. We are back in March with February's report.